He never won the Arnold Classic, but I guarantee you that would erase years of pain and self-medication if he had won one Arnold Classic. But by not winning that, I think it, it prolonged his recreational drug use. It, 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 it exacerbated the injury. He talks about the depression of not winning certain competitions. And here he is celebrated for victories that he doesn't even really care about. It's the ones that he didn't win that took him into this dark depression. I was with a crew of people who, you know, we was, we was just stuck and sticking together tight. We, we did everything together. You know, and I had the chances to jump back into what I was doing and I didn't take it. You know, I thought, you know, these people love me as much as <laughs> they say they do, you know. But it was a it was drugs involved. Just one night I got high and it was just like crazy shit. Fucking threesomes and women like staying there two or three days in a row. Everybody's just naked the whole time. That turned into me isolating myself for three months at a time, four months at a time. Four days out of the week, you fucking not even, you're just in a whole nother world. You know, I've been around crack all my life. I never thought to even touch any of that stuff. And to, um, let myself go on that side was, you know, disappointing to myself, but also I felt like I needed to escape. I wanted to escape my life. It was, a lot of, it was just a lot of pressure to handle. And what are you gonna do with that pressure when you have the money to do what you want to do? Chris went through uh, later on in life, spawned from other things that was driven behind uh, in his mind that he was dealing with. It's like a, a computer and it has a virus and you have no idea why your computer is acting up, but it's something running behind the background that you can't see. And I think that's really what driven, you know, Chris to go to the, the, the dark side of the things that he's did is privately some things that he was just going through. Because I mean, if you're just a super happy and complacent, very confident uh, person in yourself, you never follow those things. You're smarter than that.